What is going on everyone? Welcome to the video. We are one week out from doing the photo shoots in Toronto in New York. So that is why I'm out by the pool getting a tan. Not necessarily to make myself darker, but to like clear up my skin. For whatever reason, when I tan a little bit right before a photo shoot or contest, it clears up my skin. I guess it dries it out. Uh, so I got up this morning and did cardio. I just did Tabata on the row machine and then did 40 minutes of step meal. And now we are back home, so I tan for about only like 30 minutes, and now we're gonna go inside, relax for a little bit, and then we're going to New Fit at two o'clock, so right now it is around one o'clock. So we're about to head over there and work out some back. So to give you all a little update on my physique one week out, I woke up this morning at 184. I think that's where I'm gonna be steadily staying at. Uh, I'm not like, it's not changed at all in the last few days, so I think that's right around the weight I'll, I'll be staying at. So, just give y'all, like I said, a little update. Am I where I want to be? No. Will I get there? I don't know. We'll see in the next week. I mean, I can't do much in a week. Today's Monday, and I fly out next Monday, and the photo shoot is on a Tuesday. So, can I lose a lot of body fat in that time period? I don't know. I am on, let's see, uh, tomorrow will be a full week, seven days of zero carbs, so, so I'm going keto. Uh, and I'm feeling horrible, absolutely drained. I am flat as a pancake. This is this is bad. This is a mind game for me because I'm looking in the mirror. I'm smaller than what I was just a week ago. I don't look as good as what I looked a week ago because I was having carbs. And I don't have any veins coming out because I'm flat as a pancake. So it is a super mind game. This is all this is. I'm looking in the mirror thinking, okay, I look like crap. But uh, when I start carving up, if I carve up, uh, I will start that uh, next Monday, so I'm hoping that I'll be able to get a pump for the photo shoots and the video shoots, uh, but we will see what I end up doing. Uh, the problem is with carving up, if you're not lean enough and you carb up, you will uh, spill over and you don't look as good. So if I don't feel I'm lean enough uh, come Monday or Sunday of this week, then I will not carb load, I will just stay pretty much flat. Uh, so that I look leaner. That is the thing. Normally, if I carb up and I'm not lean enough, I look like I'm overweight. Not really overweight, but have a lot more body fat than what I actually do. So, I'm just going to flex a little bit, give y'all a physique update, abs. I mean, I look leaner. You know, like my lower abs can show more than what they were. But, like I said, I'm just not full. I'm just not veiny. And, you know, I want both. Of course, you want both, especially for a contest. Uh, but, you know, photo shoot, you know, I would love to be as big as I can, as ripped as I can, of course. But, yeah, so we'll see what I can do in a week. But, who knows? So now I'm going to go relax a little bit, take a shower, because I still have not taken a shower after cardio this morning and laying out. So I'm going to take a shower, have a protein shake, and then we're going to go over to New Fit and try to kill it. I'm going to be completely dead throughout this workout. Like, I'm dead just laying down. I'm like, oh my gosh. So working out is going to be a killer, but we're going to make it happen. And I just realized Gainer has not been in the vlog very much at all. So you want your camera time? Come on. He's shy. <laughs> all right, dude. So when I talk, you want to be in the camera, but then when it's all you... You don't want to be in it. <laughs> Gainer. Oh my gosh. Gainer. Do something. Oh, don't show those teeth. All right, ready? Every side. Ready? Let's uh, try to get the wires in there too. Ready? Go. Take 
jack up the electricity. Nice, Abel. Oh, fell again. Are you serious? <laughs> So glad to be done with that workout. Uh, did a really good back workout. I was surprised by how much energy I had and how much I could actually push myself today during that back workout. I finished off with abs, did not record it. I just had the machine on and just laid there for, hang on a minute, let me put this in the car. But I had the machine on and laid there for just like six minutes just contracting my abs and that was the whole entire workout. And now I am headed home to get some protein in my system because after those workouts, I'm telling you, you need to recover. So came in, had a protein shake, and now sitting around, I am getting more and more dead. Like at the workout times, I'm really good. I get my energy uh, up and then afterwards it starts slowly going down. So now I'm crashing. It is 5.30. It looks like it is like eight o'clock because look outside, it is raining. Uh, this whole entire week, oh no, we got the ring again. We got a ring. Every time it rains, we got a ring in the window. I don't know why. Yeah. But yeah, every single uh, day this week, it's been like gloomy. Like one time it's like sunny and then the next like 10 minutes it's like raining. So it, it can't make up its mind. So right now I'm going to get Shelby to actually get this baby oil stuff and put it on my chest and get this little rubber thing here that I bought like a year ago, used it once. Uh, it's supposed to like get out the knots in your muscles. So I'm actually going to get her to press in the inside of my chest because I am sore from working out at New Fit on Friday and you know, today's Monday, so it's been a while, but my chest is sore and I don't want my chest being sore because tomorrow I'm actually doing a collab with someone. Uh, so you will see that video uh, tomorrow, but doing a collab and we're gonna be working chest and I want it to be as you know less sore as possible because he's really strong at chest. So I know I wanna be left behind doing this collab because he, is way stronger than me and me being uh, carb depleted for over a week now uh, does not make up for very high strength so yeah I'm gonna get her to rub to mash on my chest a little bit and we'll see if that helps with the soreness and then I don't know probably eat in about an hour because I am hungry like in the inside of I gotta right rub the in there. oil around first oh fudge <laughs> Sorry. oh that hurts but it, it's good oh. You want the vlog to see you cry? I could mash really hard. Yeah. I mean, it needs to be pushed out because there's a lot of tension. But the main thing, it's really sore in the inside. Oh my gosh, that hurts so bad. Mm. Gator's like, what is going on, Dad? <laughs> so we got our lazy butts up finally. We relaxed for around probably an hour. And now we're gonna go knock out some cardio cardio before dinner because I know once I eat dinner, I just wanna I'm gonna wanna relax again. So Shelby came with us today to help motivate. <laughs> yeah. And we're gonna go to the apartment complex and just I don't know, walk on a treadmill or something. I just need to get in about like 30 more minutes of steady state just to burn as many calories as possible. Just a week out, so I can do this. I can do this. I keep saying a week out, Don't but really, yeah, it's a lot of water. 
I always keep saying like a week out, but really it's way longer than that because uh, I got a lot more stuff after this photo shoot, but this is the main thing. So I just need to get through next week, uh, be in the best shape as possible, and then after that I should just be able to maintain. One eternity later. Just as fast as we went in, we're out. <laughs> we just went straight into 30 minutes and now we're out of there and now we're gonna go let out Gander from his kennel. We cannot leave him out of his kennel at all for any amount of time because uh, the last times we did he was chewing up my tennis shoes and so we're scared to do it at all. Uh, especially when I'm low carb, I couldn't handle it. Like if I came in and my shoes were gone, I might kill the poor dog, or not poor dog at that point. But so yeah, we just leave him in his kennel for any, we just have to lock him up and get him out. So now we're gonna go in, it is probably around like 6.40. What time is it? 7.15. 7.15, way off. And uh, we're gonna go in here and eat some dinner. Just got in from doing cardio. Shelby is rinsing off uh, before we cook dinner. I wanna go over some stuff, uh, like peak week of a photo shoot and stuff, exactly what I'm doing. So what I have planned out uh, this week. Uh, first off, uh, as you saw, I went and tanned to get like my skin ready for uh, the photo shoot just to like, clear up my skin. Uh, second, I am whitening my teeth a whole lot. I'm not sure the whitening company that I use for this. I forgot what this is, but um, I don't whiten my teeth all year round. I know I should. I just drink a lot of coffee, so I feel like it's just, you know, more harm on my teeth because that, you know, because I will wipe my teeth and immediately will have coffee and so it darkens it up. So I feel it harms my teeth doing that. So I just wipe my teeth leading up to like, you know, like a photo shoot or a contest and that's mainly the only time I really whiten my teeth. Uh, I have my hair appointment or I need to make my hair appointment later on this week. Uh, I'm not sure the hairstyle I'm gonna be going with with this photo shoot. I'm sure it's gonna be shorter on the sides. The top needs to be a little bit shorter, especially on uh, the back end of my hair because when I spike it up like I'm doing right now, I have this fin because it's really long. So I, I'm thinking about keeping the front longer uh, and the back a little bit shorter. And so I gotta get my hair cut. And then uh, coming Sunday, I guess I'll get my spray tan. I need to get like a you know spray tan to make my skin way darker for the photo shoots because of course when you have a lot of light you get washed out and your muscles don't show as much so I'll be getting a photo or I'll be getting a spray tan on Sunday what else what else uh cardio and stuff's going to be staying the same workouts are staying the same I'm not changing anything up I'm not going to do like card depletion workouts that I normally do uh just because I uh you know I'm be going into the photo shoot uh doing like four, three days of shooting and video uh, shoot. So it's not only a photo shoot, I'm gonna be actually working out, doing workout videos for muscle and fitness. So I don't really need to, you know, card deplete for all this because I have uh, photo shoots and video shoots back to back. It's not just one day. Uh, so, you know, nothing's gonna change with my workouts. Cardio is gonna, like I said, gonna be staying the same. Uh, nutrition, I'm gonna stay on the keto diet until I guess uh, like Monday, uh, if I'm gonna carb up or not. I more than likely will carb up because the more and more I look at myself, the more and more I think I need carbs uh, leading to the photo shoot because I'm so flat. And I hardly, I mean today at New Fit, that was the most pump I've seen in a few days. And that's bad. Uh, when you work out, you should be able to see you know veins and get a good pump but right now being so low carb and stuff i'm not seeing any of that and i need that for the video shoots and the photo shoots uh other than that i can't think of anything else i'm really going to change up i'm drinking a lot more water right now uh so i'm trying to at least get in like uh two gallons a day uh, and then uh you know monday rolls around i'll just like drink normal uh getting on the plane and everything else uh, because of course i can't go through the airport with a gallon jug so just drinking tons until next week. But besides that, uh, I think that's really about it. So when she gets out of the shower, I'm gonna jump in there, rinse off, and then we're gonna eat some dinner. We just got done watching a movie called We Before You. Me before you. Oh, Me Before You? Yeah. Me Before You, I don't know what I just said. What did I say? You said We. We Before You? Like oh, so Me Before You. 
It was, uh, you know, it's a girls' movie, and uh, it came out, I don't know how long ago, but I was like, absolutely, I'm not watching that movie. So Shelby went and saw it with my sisters back a long time ago, and we just got done watching. It was a pretty good movie. It was very sad, uh, but it was actually entertaining until the last bit, and then you're just like, really? That really happened? But it was a pretty good movie, I must say, even for a gr girls' movie. Uh, now it is around uh, 1045, having the last meal of the night. It is the frozen protein pudding that I made earlier, right when I got done eating dinner. It is just a scoop of casein powder, scoop of whey protein powder, uh, serving of peanut butter, and some a lot of almond milk, maybe a cup of almond milk. And Mr. Gaynor is over here asleep on the couch. He's like, what? And so I'm gonna eat that and head to bed tomorrow. I've gotta get up pretty early because I gotta edit some vlogs. And then I have actually a collab with a guy that is a uh, local in Austin, Texas, so you will see that tomorrow. We're gonna be working some chest. Looking forward to that. I have been talking to this guy for maybe two, three months on collabing. We just had too much going on and like when I could do it, he couldn't do it. So we just never could find a time that was good to for us to both collab. And finally he was like, hey man, come on down this week. And uh, so we're gonna make it happen tomorrow. Uh, it's going to be like tomorrow afternoon sometime, I think around 1 or 2 o'clock in the afternoon. So really looking forward to that. It's going to be awesome. Uh, this will be actually my first real collab. I have done, yeah, no, this is the only collab really uh, that I've done. So this will be the first one. I'm really looking forward to it. But I'm going to sit here, enjoy this, and then go to bed because, like I said, got to get up early. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you like the videos. I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can this past, uh, this next week because it is le leading up to a photo shoot and a lot of people have questions as far as you know what exactly you do. And uh, I'm gonna take you along the process for sure, going, uh, you know, flying out to Toronto, New York, and Boise, Idaho, so I'm gonna take y'all with me. All right guys, hope you liked the video. Please give the video a thumbs up if you did. I will see y'all next time. All right guys, peace. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that does not look right. <laughs> that looks gross. <laughs>